Oh yeah. <laughs> hey guys, today I'm sharing what our night routine looks like. And we always start out by eating dinner as a family. Getting Ale to sleep by a decent time is super important to us so she can have a full night's rest and be her best self during the day. And we can have some mom and dad alone time at night to unwind. After dinner, we let Ale have a little playtime. She loves to dance. G and I are trying to teach her how to salsa right now. <laughs> so then we head upstairs for bath and bed. Ali loves her bubble baths. She never wants to get out. We wash her hair and body with Johnson's Baby Cotton Touch shampoo. And the scent is really fresh and soothing, which helps her relax before bedtime. You can help your baby to establish a better night's sleep by following the same exact bedtime routine every night. And we've been doing this routine with Ali since she was about six months old. I love watching these clips because you can see how much she loves her bath time. It's always her favorite time of the day. After her bath, I use Johnson's Shiny and Soft Conditioning Spray to help detangle her hair and protect it before brushing. I can't believe how long her hair is getting now. I'm gonna have to start blow drying it actually, it's getting so long. Then we always apply lotion to protect her sensitive baby skin. We love Johnson's Classic Baby Lotion, which I apply all over her body and her face. When Ale was about three months old, we took an infant massage class and we still use some of those same techniques to help her relax and unwind at night. We put on long-sleeved PJs and socks, just so she's super cozy all night long, even if she kicks off her blanket. Then it's time to brush and floss. She actually loves flossing. I'm, I don't think that's normal for a two-year-old, but these baby flossers definitely help. They're shaped like uh, little zoo animals, so it makes it fun for her, and you can pick them up at most grocery stores. Then I turned on her sound machine, and it's story time. I let her pick two books. The first one I read with her in my lap while we're in the rocking chair, and then the second one we read when she's in bed. I love that she knows exactly what to expect every night and doesn't fight us on getting to sleep. I can't stress enough how important the routine is. It is a lengthy process and commitment, but she always sleeps through the night and it helps us have our alone time and her to wake up in a good mood the next day. Both Gabriel and I follow the exact same routine, so she always knows what to expect. Ali's still sleeping in her crib, but we're gonna have to transition her to a toddler bed soon, so we'll see how that goes. That might need to be a whole nother video. But for now, it's good night, lights out, and sweet dreams. <laughs>